In terms of things that are unique about the avian respiratory system, birds do have complete tracheal rings, and so that's different than our mammal patients. So the patients then have uh, very, um, th their tracheas are not compressible, and so when we're restraining them, uh, we don't want to put pressure on the keel, because since they don't have a diaphragm, the keel is how they're breathing. Um, but because the tracheal rings are complete, then we can put pressure across the neck and not have to worry about hurting the tracheas. Another thing that's different about birds is that they don't have a diaphragm, and so if they have pathology in their salomic cavity, if they have fluid or an egg or a mass, it can compress the respiratory system and the air sacs, and they can potentially have complications, um, even drown if there's fluid that enters the lung space.